So in Alaska, a wind farm has bought refurbished towers, components, turbines, and all kinds of stuff from uh, uh, something in Brussels, in Belgium. And they're upgrading the turbine in Belgium to newer, bigger units. And I'm super interested in knowing what the energy payback and CO2 payback is of a fully reused wind turbine. And so uh, so in Alaska, not a lot of details on the story, except for the key ones. They're taking four refurbished two megawatt turbines from Belgium, moving them to Alaska. And those units have been used for 10 years. And whoever's got them decided they wanted to upgrade their facility. And, and instead of throwing them in the garbage or even recycling them, they're being reused. So in, in the in the efficiency world, it's reduce, reuse, recycle. Now, reduce is efficiency. Drive less, eat less, you know, be healthy. Uh, reuse, though, before it goes to the trash, take that thing, fix it up, throw it back out there. And is it going to be up there for another 10, 15, 20 years? I have no idea. But I'm absolutely infatuated that I learned about that. I literally learned of this this morning. So this is fresh hot off the press news for me. <laughs> and so I'm still like you know, thinking about it. And so the number one thing I think is cool is, uh, you know, normally we talk about six months to a year for the CO2 and the electricity that it takes to build a wind turbine to get paid back. Uh, what's this going to be a year or a month, two months, because we're reusing. I, I wish I knew what percentage, how many extra components, but I, this is going to be like the most energy efficient, CO2 efficient wind turbine installation ever. And that totally excites me. So, I don't know. I'm watching it, checking it out. Um, so that's that's our Alaska wind turbine story. It's going to keep moving, and uh, we'll go on to the next one that I want to talk about.